Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to your channel, Cars, Guns, and Fun. So, we had some fun a few days ago, so now it's time to clean this uh, Colt revolver. So, safety check, empty. You like that click, huh? Okay. Okay, so now I'm going to remove the the cylinder gotta be really careful not to scratch it okay so first thing to remove this okay got it out Removing the guide rod. Okay, it's out. Okay, got it. So here is the cylinder. Doesn't look that bad from here. But check this out. A lot of carbon. Oh man, it's so black. So that's the reason that I use this one and I just want to keep the original really nice and, and golden clean. So let's see how it is all carbon right here. It is bad carbon, not nice. So we're going to remove you right there. I mean, whatever we can, right? So, okay. So I'm going to begin by getting some of this wet with uh, carbon remover. This is really good. I, I really recommend this product. So, okay, so I just gotta be careful not to get the uh, chemicals on the gold. And it's, it's coming out, but uh, it is really, really bad. Yeah, it's coming really good here, see? Yeah, so we were shooting this at uh, the indoors. Uh, I already posted the videos. And uh, this Colt is really accurate. It's really, really fun to shoot. Especially because of the single action side gate. And, and it's really fun. Takes longer than a semi-auto, but uh, it's fun. So this is probably like uh, the third time that uh, we shoot this one. This part is going to be kind of tough to clean, but uh, 
doesn't have to be perfect just to apply okay, I'm gonna pass the poor snake a little bit of board cleaner in this area Okay, I think I'm gonna do it one more time. I think that should be fine. Just trying to see how hard is this carbon in this area. Okay, we got some adapter. You can see pieces of carbon here on the paper. Okay, I'm putting a bit more uh, carbon remover. I think I have to use a small brush I'm just going to do one more time on this one.
Okay, the board is pretty clean. I don't know if you can maybe try to, to find it. Okay, so now this is going to be the hard part. Yeah, this cylinder is uh, just uh, polished, so I'm not worried about uh, Okay, I mean, I think, I mean, not, it's not perfect, but it's a lot better than how it was. Okay, I think it's going to be fine just like that. Yeah, I think it's okay. I mean, you can see that it's... Uh, Because these uh, parts right here are not uh, carbon, this is just uh, uh, because of the heat, it's kind of like a rainbow because of the heat, but it's, it's good, I mean, I just want this one to, to shoot it, and then that, that one is the, is the one that I really care for, so let me just uh, shoot this dry yeah so not, not it's it's okay i mean you can see that it's not uh, as bad as before so i'm going to proceed to assemble the 24 carat cylinder Just need to make sure to align it 
properly. bit of oil okay. okay so maybe you can do a close up here because we need to make sure this section right here is going to be right by the groove so we can get the screw on the right position Now let's make sure that is uh, leaking. I'm not gonna direct try fire, okay? Yeah, perfect. Uh, finally, that's kind of. Um, Okay, so finally we got it done. So this is the box that uh, came with the Colt revolver. It's really nice and engraved on the bottom. So this one, uh, I have some information here that I just uh, did some research. So this one, it's a Frontier Scout 22LR produced from 1957 to 1970. This is the model 1965, only 700 made. And this is the number 519. So I'm lucky to have this one. Okay, there you have it. And also have the cold horse. Thank you for watching the channel. And this one is going to be next. But I will do a separate video on that one. Thank you for watching the video. And subscribe for more. Thank you.